Today, the Baltimore Orioles hosting the Toronto Blue Jays, and it's the first home game for the O's since the riots broke out last month. And another sign that things are getting back to normal now in Charm City. Our John Gonzalez is at Camden Yards with the excitement from fans. Well, another sign that things are definitely getting back to normal here in downtown Baltimore. Utah Street has reopened in anticipation for tonight's home game. You can see workers here at the stadium are getting the final touches in for what would normally not be a very significant home game in the start of May. But, well, this is a lot more than just a home game. It's what's being called a reopening. The Orioles playing their first home game since the riots broke out here in Baltimore. There is a grassroots effort by a group of residents pushing for fans to try to sell out the stadium tonight. They've been going door to door, going to different businesses, passing out flyers, hoping that unity around this beloved sports team will be a big step toward pulling Baltimore together. It was an idea inspired by a friend about, uh, you know, giving the, a fresh start for Baltimore. Personally, myself, I lived in New York. It's September 11th, 2001, so I saw how a city can rally behind a baseball team during a difficult time. It's not a home game if you don't have your home crowd there to cheer you on. So this game is kind of important, and it kind of like will bring the city back together again. Sports are, about, are supposed to be about community, and this is going to be the community coming together. So the group that created this reopening idea, hoping to see these seats nice and packed tonight, there's also a food drive at many of the local bars tonight, hoping to collect some of that money that they lost in a city that was taken over by riots and National Guard and more than 250 fires. Well, things are definitely getting back to normal here in Charm City. In Baltimore, John Gonzalez, ABC 7 News.